Hello friends, this video on body movements part 15 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So that was all about bones. So let us now talk about cartilage because it is the next important part of the skeletal system. So what is a cartilage? So cartilage is a semi-transparent, elastic and flexible connective tissue. Now like bones are totally hard. So they are not at all flexible but cartilage on the other hand they are elastic they are flexible so they are not as hard as bones so when you look at this picture you see this is a bone this is also a bone so where the two bones are connected that is a joint and just on the outer side of the bone you have a tissue like structure which is again elastic and flexible so it connects different parts of our body so that is a cartilage So mature cartilage is relatively solid. Now it is not that it is totally flexible. It has some flexibility as compared to bones, but it is uh, it is a solid structure. So we find we do not find cartilage everywhere, but in certain specific parts of our body. For example, nose, ear, trachea. Now the cartilage present in the ear is very easily visible. Now have you ever noticed? So have you observed that if, if you want you can just check it, you can just try it in your ear. So you would see that certain parts of the ear, for example this part of the ear is neither very soft nor very hard. I mean it is not as hard as a bone that you cannot move it, you cannot twist it. So it is like relatively solid structure, neither as hard as bone nor very soft. So this is where cartilage is present. Similarly the nose. If, if you touch your nose, you put a little bit of pressure and try to move it, what happens? You see that it moves, but it is not that it moves completely, but some kind of movement is there and that is due to the cartilage, due to the elasticity of cartilage. It is also there in the trachea, now trachea is the wind pipe, when we breathe in, so that air passes through a wind pipe inside our body. Now we cannot see that wind pipe, so we, can, we can, can't really feel the presence of trachea there presence of cartilage there so these are some of the areas in our body where cartilage is present now it is also found in covering of bones in movable joints so wherever you have movable joints the synovial joints or uh, whether it is a hinge joint or a ball and socket joint so in all of those movable joints the bones are covered by a layer of cartilage like how you see here so this is a bone it is covered by a cartilage and this is the joint so at the joint area when two bones in between the two bones when you have cartilage there is some flexibility because the cartilage can at least be moved because it is flexible and elastic so due to the presence of this party presence of the cartilage which is uh, softer than the bone the movements are also allowed the importance of cartilage is that it maintains shape and flexibility of the organ and also supports the structure. Now since it is not very soft, so it can support the structure. But since it is elastic, so it can give some flexibility. So you can actually move that part to some extent. So that's the important thing about cartilage. Thank you. Please visit www.examfear.com to watch more educational videos with a better experience. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for latest updates. Thank you once again.